All right. Yes. Wow, everything's locked. It's great. The directorial override is right there in the control room. How do we get there? Surrounded by a bunch of hiss. Time to cleanse this. Nice and clean. Hey, hey, I am a janitor. I will cleanse it. Alright, Black Rock Quarry. That door's locked, so I guess I'm going right side anyway. I did it. Stop screaming at me. Threshold remnant. Level 4 clearance over there. Find Ati. Down here. Now that leads down those staircases that I saw beforehand. Ah, the hush is gone now. Or the hiss. Sorry, I called the hush. What's down that way? First, I want to talk to Ati. God, you haven't cleaned this floor at all. Well done. You got the job. It's place for congratulations. Yippee, Sadana. It happened in the last drop. I truly need an assistant. Funny thing is... I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look, we need to get the lockdown lifted, otherwise I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy peasy. It's just around the corner. But first... We need to get you working. Very small couple of hours job. Something tells me it's going to be more than that. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. You think there's a dog buried in this? Yes, I do. I can tell you are not the yesterday's Krause's son. That's why you make a great assistant. Very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. I'm not going to say particularly sure that this house has a vermin problem. A bad one. They've already messed up the cooling pumps. And the power generators of a power plant, particularly. And the pensioner inside is starting to feel the band around his head tighten. Mm -hmm. 
The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up and we all disappear like a fart in Sahara. Trying my best to keep up with this. Fix the coolant pumps and the power generators, otherwise the power plant will blow. But don't you worry. I've left you clear instructions. You'll catch the end of the trip before <laughs> I go <come laughs> on vacation. The works on the task board here, you can do later, when you have time. Vacation? Right. Yes, no one's gonna cancel my holiday or seeds gonna rattle. But Bro. don't worry at all, you'll take care of it. You can hear my inner thoughts. This crisis gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. That's great. Thank you, Ati. Alright. What other what other job is there? Burn yep. the trash. Burn the trash. Throw it in the fire. Burn it all. Burn it into a reindeer. Not ah, nice shortcut. All right, that's a shortcut. Okay, so what happens again if that thing blows up? Power. Explosion. Too much. Director's duty. Keep the lights on. All right. Nice elevator. Chase. Strange light in the break room. Lots of side quests available to me too. Hey, you're friendly. As far as I can tell. Hey, hey, are you new? And go talk with Chief Arish in the security booth. He's in charge here. All right. Ma'am! Hey! Chief Arish, FBC security. Shouldn't you be in a safe room? I'm a new director. They all have HRAs. We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah. Chief Arish, FBC security. I'm just... Oh, hang on, you're the new director. <laughs> um, it's a pleasure, <laughs> ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, as you can probably tell, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and my crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. NSC? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing? <laughs> uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. See, what's inside is dangerous. The Dr. Darling seemed to know it would be a target. Darling? He's here? No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. He smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerabilities and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? What the fuck? <laughs> crazy dude. Darling knew the hiss was coming. Well, not that Listen, crazy. I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before this baby blows. I'll have my guys unlock the doors out of here for you. I'll take care of it. You stay and keep the hiss away from the plant if you can. The hiss? That's what we're calling him? Well, that's catchy. <laughs> oh, listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll right. keep an eye out for him. All right. He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. Well, his other boss just committed... Try uh, to stay alive. Committed unalive. 
Hey, you have any other things you can talk about? When the converter's in... I hope. What do you know about the hit? Not much. Only what I've seen. Well, they use the same tactics that Marshall and Salvador taught us, which makes me think that the hiss haven't completely erased the peach. Is a pre or they're just using whatever they find in their victims' heads. In any case, they are really eager to get... Why do you think that is? Shit, I don't know. They want to make my life harder? The Arish. What do you do here, Arish? Security chief of the maintenance sector. I make sure all the weird shit down here doesn't bother. Learned everything I know from Salvador. The best security agent this bureau has ever seen. And you like your job? I love it. You know, everyone thinks that maintenance is the lowest rung on the ladder just because we fix pipe. I gotta be honest, I'm proud to work with them. I've done a few odd jobs with these kind of folks. They say what they mean. I like that. Oh, all right. Service weapon? What do you know about the service weapon? <sighs> Not much. The thing is director only. Salvador told me by the time he saw Trench use it. Sounds like that gun can do some serious damage. Yeah, I did see pictures of it once, though, and uh, it looks different to that thing you're carrying. You monitor something? It's new. Is new a good thing? Given the circumstances, I'd say new is our best bet. All right. Caught up the power plant. What exactly is the power plant? Listen, I only know what Salvador told me, but I know it generates all the electricity for the Bureau, and it's got two very simple rules. Rule one, keep it below a certain temperature. Rule two, don't ever, ever open it. Oh, and three, uh, it's classified, so I shouldn't ask. Sounds like secrets are standard. It's all part of the job. All right, and Ati. Do you know this Ati guy? <laughs> of course, he's my favorite coffee break buddy. Dude has got some crazy stories. And he probably knows more than anyone else around here. If you can make sense of what he's saying. Any idea where he's from? I'm guessing Sweden. Uh, he's from where he's from. Look, there are just some stones that are. All right, I guess that's it. I should got a lockdown though. Oh, I can. I forgot. I can jump. Ah, loot. All right. Better. Coolant pumps are over there. I don't know what the fuck those designs were, but they were not pretty. Oh! The equivalent of suiciders. understand why they were having so much trouble. Jesus Christ. If they were just regular hits, I'd say, what is, that's not that hard. Nah, they are suicide bombers. Power plant, furnace chamber, ah. He did ask me to burn the shit in the furnace. My work, it lays the parts. How the hell do you want me to replace the part? Oh, right there. That's how. Alright, let me get some ammo. Somehow. All right. 
right, I guess we killed most of them. All right, cleanse. Cleanse this area from all this filth. Come forth. Into the light. I hope I'm doing this correct. All it says is burn the trash. My name is Dr. Pierce. Leave me. Oh, maybe it's the radioactive. I crashed it. Ating barrels full of hazardous biological like Yep, that's what he meant. Environmental regulations on waste disposal. But if that's what Ati wants, then I'll get it done. God damn it. Yeah, I gotta recharge this. <laughs> Gotta dump it inside the thing. And fire! Fire! Alright. More junk down here. More notes. I know there's a couple more down here. At least three. There should be two more down here, at least. Or maybe it was just one more. I thought I saw another one from up top, but maybe I already got it. Alright, it's only one more left then. Dude, that's an empty one. We burned that, so we're done here. It's a good spot to end this episode, though. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a comment below. The comment didn't over there, and we'll see more stuff in the little kitchen. Anyways, catch you guys later. Peace. I am known by many names: Mountain Slayer, Underlion, the Chocolate Ass. But you, you may call me Tiffany. Is there any more markers around that can stick up my ass?